a while. That is very off mark. Hang on, let me adjust. Oh no, the immersion. On the right side, at least let it finish that uh, bit of the soundtrack. And just in time, too, for an ad, which I immediately closed out of. But anyway, welcome back, everyone, to some more Metal Year. Yeah, right now, uh, I might just randomly have to go and do something, because I have to go and check the mail, because there's a lot coming in <laughs> today. And I need to make sure that I keep an ear out for it. Oh, wait, no, I want the So I'm not too positive on where I'm supposed to go. Okay, well... It's me, your number one fan! You can only jump from this there when you... when the wind's blowing north. It usually blows south, but sometimes it changes just for an instant. That's your chance, don't miss it! Keep up the good work! Like I will be right back now. I'm just gonna go and look, I'm not gonna go and do it just yet. Yeah, I've got a feeling that this is going to be something I have to deal with all day, where I'm going to think I hear something. So he said that I have to wait. I mean, I could use the cigarette smoke to see what direction it's going in. That makes sense, right? I lost a little bit of health, but I made sure that I'm going in the right direction. Also, I don't want to risk doing anything to 
make it so that I fall, so I'm just gonna put the controller down. Also, I'm going to adjust this, because my head's kind of getting cut off. There we go. That looks good. Oh, I went backward. And we made it. I also don't have the hang glider anymore, so hopefully there's no reason for me to ever go back. Famous last words, right? <laughs> I don't like the fact that that has, like, a crack, so right try here first. Oh, great, we got a boss already. Jungle Evil. <laughs> I've been waiting for you, Snake! I am Jungle Evil! Not to be confused with my cousin, Jungle Boogie. The undisputed master of the jungle ambush. Let's see whether you're a real snake or not. Tee hee hee. Okay, so he's gonna be... Can't carry. Can't carry him or what? Okay, so we gotta wait for him to like, pop up. Question is, where is he gonna pop up? Okay, so he pops up pretty far from me. Dang it. What am I carrying that I can't carry any more of? Probably, maybe some... Ooh, can I use grenades, maybe? And then I pick up gas grenades. Oh. I can probably use grenades. This will probably be a lot easier. Oh, you can actually see him coming up to you in the top right, that's cute. Cute detail. Oh! If I crouch, will he see me? Oh, what? That's not fair. That's not fair! See, I want to kind of like test the grenades because I would think maybe the mines would also be helpful, but it's just way too inconvenient of, of like a boss for that. But I might be able to use like a box or something to trick him. Like a, that one on the left, maybe that one I can use.
Oh! Oh. Him actually popping up right next to me scared the heck out of me. Nah, that's not far enough. Or that's not, yeah, well my, my reticle is not far. Holy cow, dude. I only have one thing of food I don't, I really don't want to have to eat it right now. Weak. He's getting weak. Wow, he's all the way up there. I can barely see him. Oh, he's. He didn't want him into like, the next quadrant. Hey, he's dead. Way to go. Is there anything else in this area? Way to go. Doesn't seem to be like there's anything. Which that's unfortunate. Oh, we got key card eight, which is nice. Well, we're not gonna go up there just yet. I didn't realize, uh, Gray Fox and Big Boss were hiring from the Killzone team. Okay, does that reset? I have a feeling it does not. Oh, it does actually. Okay. Okay, 
I don't know why I've got eggs, but I've got eggs. I mean, it's gotta be important if this- if jungle evil over here was guarding it. Okay, well, it's cracked. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. I was able to get out of their walk line. Well, maybe not this one. Oh, okay, I'm good. Thanks. Uh, what? What the heck? What is it doing? What? What is... Why is there a snake? What is going on? It just ate my food. Can I get rid of it? Oh my god, I've got... No, kill me guys, kill me! I need a- I need a- Somebody kill me, I need to get rid of the snake. Kill me! Yeah, no, like this- I really hope it didn't save with both the eggs in my inventory, because if I've got this freaking snake in here, this is going to be a pain. If I have to replay, I'm fine with that. It's a waste of 20 minutes, but you know what? I'm fine with that, because it's not going to be that rough. But I don't want the snake. That is going to be an absolute pain. I just see a snake crawling through my inventory and eats my food. Okay, good. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab one egg, we're gonna let it hatch, and if it's the snake, then we're gonna die again. I don't know what the... I think you said it was like an owl or something? I don't know what the owl is about, but... Considering it wasn't moving around and eating my food, I should be fine with the owl in my inventory. How's everybody's day going? I mean, the amount of time it took to... I should be fine if I just leave. It's like, there was no new... Uh, save point. And it took a bit for the egg to hatch. So I should be fine. So 
still hasn't cracked yet. Again, the fact that you can go from the box to the bucket is really funny to me. still say it's the egg. I, it looks like an owl. Why does it still say egg? It's clearly an owl. animals in the room northwest of here. I hear owls at night. It's so scary. I can't sleep. Know what? At night, they turn off the power. So all of the laser fences get turned off too. That's when we get to... That's... Then we get to play inside as long as the grown-ups don't catch us. Okay. What, do I have to, like, wait for night or something? Oh, another ration. Nice, I'll take it. Up and away, owl! Shazam! Go! Go! Go, owl, go! Oh. That actually worked. Lots of rats in the jail. 
They steal all kinds of things and take them back to their nests. The grown-ups put out sulfuric acid to try to get rid of them. long hallway. There's no way that this is not going to have something. Well, at least I know it's not going to be a trap door. Let's try this way first, because clearly this is guarding something. probably a path that I had to... Yeah, I'm looking at the map now. Oh, now I'm going to wait for this guy to come back around. probably gonna be something in the basement levels, right? Oh, what was we go? Yeah. It's me, your number one fan! Snake, watch yourself! You've got company, Night Fright! The last surviving member of the Whispers. I'm sorry, what? You know, the legendary gorilla unit. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Night Fright. He's wearing a state-of-the-art camouflage suit that makes him pr practically invisible. Oh, great. I love invisible enemies. Not only that, he'll attack you with a gun that's completely silent. No one has ever seen his face. You know what you have to do, right? Lucky me. I've got a fan club. Use your ears, Snake. Over and out. Squeaking on the like wooden tiles. What the heck is this? Oh, it just like ate my chocolate. Oh, uh, this is probably something I need to do later, though, which means oh, I should not have. I shouldn't have eaten the chocolate one. Okay, maybe this will like spawn me before the boss fight. I had like the perfect amount for this.
couldn't do that in immediate one go. I needed to at least have one of the food, which is a shame because now I'm gonna have no food. I need to find another key card. You all better still be chocolatized when I get back. Okay, there's like no buildings. Or no like rooms in this building. Great. I don't think there's going to be any higher floor. Yeah. Okay, I just need to remember... I see inside of this. I cannot. I just need to remember that... Which building this one is. Oh, hey, more food spawned over there. I might actually be able to go grab that. Well, at least that was something. Oh, there's that side of room right there. Maybe I can grab uh, uh, food from that side. I'm trying to remember how to say food. I'm like, food. such a workplace hazard. I swear, if you need, like, nine, you'd be annoyed. Dang it, I was trying to get up here. Chocolate, Mister. Do you have a B1 ration? B1 rations have chocolate in them. Ah, uh, I'm just gonna use them all up, kid. The one-eyed man is like our daddy. He doesn't like grown-ups. I feel like you've said one of you said this to me before. Okay, well, a little stuck right now. Oh no, he didn't actually come up here. Nice. Okay, I'll take it. Okay, well I've checked... I think I've checked all the rooms. Where else can I go? I mean, 
Oh right, I did pick one up, so yeah, I could have given that to the kid if the game gave me that as an option. I guess that wasn't an option. Hmm. Still don't know what this brooch is for. those conveyor belts. Maybe it's on one of them? Like one of those things? The question is, like, how would I be able to get out? are now, re like, respawn ones. Now I'm back up to three, which has me worried that they are going to just, like, eat up the food again. Is that simple? Oh no, where am I going? Oh my god, I'm all the way back here? better bring me back all the way up there. Okay. And that means there's a reason for that. There's a reason that we're able to go that way. Is there something in here I missed? I mean, it was a big empty field. There's gotta be something around here. I guess the big empty field isn't exactly the best. I'm sorry. What? 
Why is it there? Why? Well, okay, the question is, I went there, right? I, I'm not crazy. I went, I went to that spot. Why is it there now? Like, did I have to kill... What was his name? Night Fright? Night Dummy or whatever? I don't know. And now it's there? Like, did it fall out of his pocket when I killed him? Again, I love the fact that I can just run around with a bucket on me. Okay, well, we got Keycard 9. I don't fully understand how that one makes sense, but I don't think it really does. Oh my God. How do you see me? Okay. The logic is lost. This game has really weird styles of thinking right now. Like, I'm just thinking of the dumbest possible things and it's turning out to work out for me and I really don't feel like it should. be able to get card 9 from Jungle Evil. I I already did that number one fan. Don't you mean card 8? He only had card 8. No, he was in charge of cards 8 and 9. He must have dropped it somewhere. Check the area he was in. The card should be there. Keep up the good work. You are really behind right now. I would have loved to have known that prior. already passed away. His heart couldn't take it anymore. Wait. What's that bruise on his neck? Not to worry, Snake. Marv may be dead, but the plans for Oilex are safe. Marv was a very careful man. He left behind a copy of the plans in case of an emergency. He had a reputation as a video game enthusiast. He even used to have them shipped to him from the West every month. A few days ago, he did some microfilm in the circuit board of one of the game cartridges. It was an MSX cartridge made by the Japanese company called Konami. MSX. That's the world's <laughs> selling brand of computer, isn't it? <laughs> then he 
hid the cartridge inside that locker. It's the key. I don't know. It couldn't... I couldn't get it out of him. I mean, he never told me. Snake, you're in danger! Holly, what's wrong? Snake, it's Madnar! I thought there was something strange about him, so I asked the agency to check him out. After he was rescued from Outer Heaven, apparently things didn't go well for him. His radical theories were rejected by in the West. He was dismissed as a madman and shut out from the scientific community. And as time went on, he was forgotten. Madnar isn't exa wasn't exactly happy with the scientific community either. He must have been searching for some way to get back at them. That's when Zanzibar Land talked him into becoming a double agent! He'd use his status as a scientist to feed technolog uh, technological secrets from the East and West to Zanzibar Land. Dr. Mars disappearance? Right! The timing is too perfect. Madnar must have given them every detail of Mars' itinerary in the U.S. Madnar was after oil X all along. That's why he wanted to go to America with Marv. I'm afraid you got me, Snake. I gave up everything to be part of your world. Even the country I was born and raised in. But your world has nothing but contempt and abuse for me. I just wanted to finish Metal Gear. It is the culmination of all my life's work in robota robotology. But your politicians were only interested in nonsense like SDI, NW, or Ned W, and brain bombs. I passed on the scientific research, the scientific secrets of the East and West to Zanzibar land. And in return, they abided, they aided me in my efforts to improve Metal Gear. Madhar, did you kill Dr. Marv? Yes. You would not share the secrets of the secret of Oilex with me. And it was I who caused Gustavo's death on the bridge by counting contacting Fox from the sewer. You thought I was urinating, but it was contacting. Bathroom break. Snake, I know, Marv. No. Gustava gave you the key to the locker. Give it to me. I can't breathe. So the brooch is the key. If it doesn't work here, then this, then the one I found was wrong. Yeah, no, this is just wrong. Okay, Master Miller. It's not fear itself that makes the difference between a hero and a coward. It's whether you've got the mental fortitude to overcome the fear to get the job done. 
over and out. Alright, well that did not help. Okay, well... Do I just leave? Like, what happens if I leave and come back? It says his body's still there. Looks like he's led a little bit more to the left. Okay, well, because I have to keep an eye out for things and it's already about 3.20 for me, I'm, I'm unfortunately going to have to call it early. But I mean, I did technically beat three bosses. Now I just got to figure out how to use the brooch as a key. But hey, that was, that's progress. But yeah, that, that'll be it for me today. I know this one was short, but hey, uh... I've got the feeling we're going to finish this either on Monday or Wednesday with the fact that like a lot of revelations are coming out. Just wonder who that last Kodak entry is. Person that I could call, but that doesn't really matter. Anyway, thanks for stopping by. Hope you all enjoyed. I I had a good time with this one. I mean, there was a there was a lot that I'm like, yeah, that doesn't really add up. But Metal Gear. What can I say? That's it for me, though. You guys enjoy your weekend. Later.